Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm going to be doing a different type of review for three different types of mug shots. I've got two of the original flavours which have been out for a while. Pasta, tomato and herb and pasta creamy cheese with new and improved recipes. And I also have a new one which is Noodle's Original Curry, which came out recently. So it's obviously, if it just came out recently, it's not gonna be new and improved. So let's see what the instructions are. It says, empty sachet into your favorite mug. Fill your mug halfway with boiling water approximately 200 millilitres and stir thoroughly leave to stand for five minutes with a stir halfway through top up if you want the sauce if you want the sauce different take a moment and enjoy so on to the second mug shot, the pasta creamy cheese. I like creamy cheese, so I'm hoping the new and improved recipe tastes really good. The instructions are the same as the instructions for the tomato and herb. Put the empty the sachet, put the boiling water, stir halfway and enjoy. On to the last one, which is the exciting new flavour, which doesn't have pasta, it has noodles. The instructions are the same as for the other two. Empty sachet, fill with boiling water, leave and stir, and enjoy. This new and exciting mug shot comes in the original curry flavour. Let's look at the traffic light system. I put them in order of how much salt they have. The first one, which is the tomato herb, has 25% of the daily intake for an adult, not a child. The second one has 30% of an adult. And the third one has 30% but has a slightly bit more than the creamy cheese one. Three of these mug shots are suitable for vegetarians. Let's look at the packaging. It says this has less than 1% fat, less than 240 calories, and made with natural flavours. And it also says new and improved recipe. The second one as well has the bar. And this has less than 2% fat, less than 280 calories and made with natural flavors. And also says new and improved recipe. Now onto the mugshot noodle. This has less than 1% fat less than 270 calories and made with natural flavors and it says new because it's a new flavor this is the back of the packaging for the tomato and herb one so let's look at what it says this has the instructions and it's ready in five minutes it says what it is there it says suitable for vegetarians there there's no artificial colours there and at the bottom it has the grams and the best before date and the grams is 64 grams. Now let's look. So we have the ingredients here and the nutritional information here. On to the back of the creamy pasta packet. It says what it is there. It says suitable for vegetarians there, has the instructions there, it says ready in five minutes there, it says no artificial colours there, it says ingredients there, 
nutritional information there. Don't recycle there. Has the barcode there. Has the best before date and the grams, which is 68 grams. So those two were the back of the packet with all the information for the past ones. Now let's look at the back of the noodles one. It has suitable for vegetarians there, no artificial colours, the instructions, ready in five minutes, what it is, barcode, address where you can phone them, ingredients, nutritional information, don't recycle, barcode, best before, and the grams, which is 68 grams, like the creamy pasta. So these are the three mug shots I'm reviewing today. So let me make them now and I'll come back to you when they're ready to ha look at the appearance and taste them. Now I have made them, it is time for the taste test. Tomato and herb mug shot. It's definitely got the sauce as it looks, but compared to how it looks on there, the pasta looks is small compared to what it looks like on the packaging. I have left all of them for five minutes stirring once, half. Wait, so let's try the tomato and herb pasta mug shot. I really taste the tomato and the herb. The tomato and herb are really strong, so it really. With the pasta wrap tastes really nice, but it, even though I'm not a big fan of tomatoes with herbs, with dry tomato, I'm not a fan of dry tomato, but it tastes nice. It's time to move on to the second mug shot, the creamy cheese pasta. So let's have a look at the creamy cheese pasta. Definitely looks creamy to me, and the pasta's big, is as it's still not as big. It's got the same problem as the tomato and herb one. The pasta's not as big as it shows on the mug. It's time for the taste test. That tastes like the original one, but better. That's way better than your original one before they improved the recipe. The cream cheese and pasta is just so, goes so well together. And it's time to move on to the final one. The noodles original curry. It's time to te taste test the noodles new original curry. This is what it looks like inside. And it's time to. I'm going to be using a spoon so it doesn't go everywhere, so I'd recommend you use a spoon. That really tastes the curry. That really tastes the curry. It's not the combination for me though. Wow, well, that was good. The noodles tasted good, but the curry flavour was a bit. I know it says mild, but it was a bit strong for me. Now you might really like it. You could choose, you could try all three or you could just try one. Though, so I'm going to rank them from third to third. <coughs> so in third place is the curry. It's because the curry was a bit too strong for me. In second place is the tomato and herb. It was just, it needs to taste a bit more and it would be perfect. And my number one favourite was the creamy cheese pasta. It was delicious, 10 out of 10. It's way better than the original one. 
You can try all three and decide which one you like the most. Or you could do it with your family. So these are pretty good. Three mug shots. So today I have reviewed tomato and herb pasta, cream and cheese pasta, and noodles, new original curry. These are really good and I really recommend. You could have them at picnics, afternoon snacks, have them while you're watching the TV, dinner, a low price warm snack during the winter. You can have them, they can have them in the middle of summer. So you could have them in picnics, on the desk, when you're working, on the go. They're really good, so I really recommend that you buy and try these. You could try different flavours, because these are only three of the many flavours. So you could have a taste adventure with these, like, choose three and then, like, do three. And then choose, like, I've did, I've chosen which one I like the most, which is this one, the creamy cheese pasta, which is delicious. So I'd really recommend that you buy these. If you like this video, please like, subscribe and hit that notifications bell. And share with your friends and family. Bye everybody.